How's it going, everybody? And welcome back to the Master League here on Pez 17 with Venencia. Last episode was definitely a heartbreaking episode as we had the draw on hand and we gave up a late goal to lose it at home. We're on the road for this episode. We need to bounce back here as October is turning into a very poor month for us. We need to get some momentum going our way here if we want to avoid being one of the bottom teams in this league. It's time to roll the dice. Three, two, one, go. We get another four. Two, three, four. We got a manager's luck. And uh, look at that. We get a get out of dilemma free card. So we're only allowed to have one of these at a time, but this will help us if we land on the dilemma anytime in the future. We can override the decision. So let's go ahead and put this down as yes, we do have a dilemma. And uh, we snub the AI tech level. It will be blue for the next match. Here's what the lineup Erickson has lined up for for his next match against Kremlin SA. We have Lazzarini and Nett, our back line of Kranjic and Modolo, the center backs of Molinaro and Fiordalicio, the fullbacks, defensive midfielder Zuccolini and Indu. Amaru holds down the attacking midfield role. We've got uh, Sensei and Capello as our wingers and Zagoni as the center forward. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a clear evening here at the Giovanni Zini here as Cremonese play host to Venencia. Cremonese having a fantastic start to the campaign. There is up to fifth place, uh, being a very potent offensive side. And while us, we have been struggling with our winless streak. Don't know the exact amount of games, but in the league, I believe we're winless in the last four. So it's going to be tough to get it done here on the road, but this could be an opportunity for the side. To make amends here, Erickson's made a few changes to his normal lineup here as far as personnel goes, and hopefully that will be the trick we need to uh, get a result here on the road. Corner being whipped in now. Oh, it's into the back of the net. An early goal for Cremonese has scored, and it's number 30, Carvalho, who gets the goal in. That is an absolute woeful start for Erickson's side. Again, it's a set-piece play. It just failed to attack the ball to the near post. Good pace on it whipped in there. and We had the bodies there, but nobody really went for the ball, it seemed like. It was just a late reaction. And, uh, Zuccolini came off the post there to challenge it, but it was just to no avail. for Capello out wide. Capello crosses it in. Zagoni's there! And uh, he just had to get it on frame. And he missed an opportunity there. First real good chance of a counterattack there. As Ferdi Alicio found Capello down the wing and he crossed it first time. It was a good ball in. Zagoni had the positioning, but that header went wide. I'm going to say with the free kick. Oh, the shot from distance. Ooh. Good effort there from the home side. They looked the better side this first half. And quality like that's no wonder. As we had numbers, but nobody going for the ball. The shot just goes wide. Oh, long go, long go. Oh, big save. Nice effort there, Capello, winning that ball back. Good ball in. Molinaro, get rid of it. Oh, no, he couldn't, and it's a goal for Cremonese. 2-0 now as Kiofani gets the goal. And that was, just poor to, that was just poor by the captain. He couldn't clear it. He was trying to clear it. He took a touch. He controlled it, and then just a the deflection as his pocket was picked by the center forward. And once again, we just don't seem to be into this match kind of scrambling a little bit and just unlucky that that deflection goes into the back of the net. Nicely done, Monticello now. Gets it down, Longo, gonna strike it from distance, but it's off balance. It's a little bit better from uh, Venencia. Some substitution seed to brought some life into the side. Monticello wins that ball nicely. Longo tried to take a strike, but just sent it over. Strike and it just goes wide and 
just feel like Venencia just don't have the impetus to really go after this game. Is uh, we're down by two goals now. Just no fire here to defend. Is to allow them to get a shot on net. And there's the final whistle. A disappointing result as Venencia just didn't show up on the day. Couldn't really threaten. Cremonese have continued with their great run in the league this season. Very few highlights to show in that one as uh, it wasn't really our game. We just didn't perform. Capello, Zagoni, those guys are just not producing at the moment. Um, you know, they're supposed to be our better forwards and they're just not getting the job done. And we just seem to be a little bit just lost the moment. I don't know if maybe Erickson needs to find a way to change his formation, but. We need to have the board give us that. Uh, this, uh, Longo coming on was huge. I think Longo has been the only bright spot as our forwards go because the rest of them are pretty disappointing. But um, that being said, it just wasn't good enough on the day um, without just a few chances and very little highlights to show from it. Um, it was a even match to say the least as I'm going to say just hunkered down defensively, didn't really give us many chances, and we were just trying to build the ball forward to get, open up space, but to no avail here. So another loss in the, in the uh, column for Erickson's side. Match day nine in the books, and we're not in, we're down the 19th, we've dropped another spot, as we have lost our fifth match in the league so far, and uh, defensively, he's going to have some questions to answer with this formation. We are now officially, I mean, we played one of the worst defensive teams, but now we are joint bottom in goals against this season. And luckily, we're just ahead of Liverano at the moment, but uh, need to find a way to turn this around here. All right, that is going to do it for us this episode. Another disappointment, to say the least, even though this is going to be a very quick episode, not a lot of highlights. But I um, hope you enjoyed it nonetheless, enjoying the struggle that we are undercome as we're trying to build this team up um, literally from the bottom of Serie B. Um, next up, let's we got one more match on Halloween. Let's hopefully we can uh, go about it and uh, turn things around. So until next time, folks, take care, and I will see you around.